hide as unscripted lots, and this is how to detect if the player chats. So, to check if and what the player chatted, we have to go into server script service and add in the script. There we have to make a player added event, and we get the variable of the player. Now we can just go, this basically always fires if a player joins, and this player variable stands for the player that joined. We can use this at any time. So now we do plr.chat colon to net function msg. Now in here we can do anything with the message and anything we want. So we should first of all pause. First of all I need to tell you about my second channel. Most people developing in Roblox Studio don't make all their models in Studio but use an external modeling app like Blender. I have made a second channel that is all about making Blender tutorials and teaches you all about it. I would very much appreciate it if you would just take a minute and check it out. It would be really nice if you would subscribe even if you don't use Blender. It just helps me in my confidence and is free. Thank you. And now back to the video. Make local message equals to msg dot lower msg and now we can just check what the message is so we can for instance check if message equals equals to e then we should do anything with the e so we could for instance kill the char player if we want so we could just write plr dot character colon break join it's up to you what you want to do with this you could also print something like a bunch of E's, you could also fire a remote event. That is up to you. We could also make something happen in general if someone chats. So we could as well print plr dot name dot dot chatted let's say msg. And now if we play test and go into chat, we can see that if we type <coughs> E, we die. It in output says E and uh, says the daughter chatted E, we should as well say hi, then we wouldn't die and it would only say the daughter chatted hi. And you could just do this for anything you want to happen if the player chats. Or you could as well make something happen if the player chats something specific, as for instance a command. So this was how to detect if and what the player chatted. I'm Scriptoblox and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!